Open an image in Photoshop and go to Filter, Filter Gallery, and then go to Brush Strokes and Angled Strokes. And you can see the result of it. It's just going in a 45 degree direction. You can see all the lines streaking off at an angle. Now that's the only options you got. Or you go to zero where you make it go off the other direction. Or you have it something in between. I want it to be all going off at 45. So set it to 100. Once you've done that, what you can also do is you can click a plus here and add it again. So if you want to you add it here, exactly the same settings. But you can also do it outside as well. So you click OK. And you can always go here, filter and filter gallery, and you can just repeat it. And then filter gallery again, so three or four times, five, six times, you can see what happens. You get these lovely streaks of noise that's just going off in the street. And you can apply it, of course, five or six times, ten times. So once you've done that, of course, and you can see it gets actually gets progressively coarser, I think, the result. So again, let's just go for filter gallery again, just final time. But also, what you can also do, you can always go to filter and maybe go down to blur and down to motion blur. So you can blur it even more and you can see the result there. Again, set it to 45 degrees for the angle, set the distance, you change that, tweak that. Now you may wish to go and color it, brighten it up a bit. You always go to image, adjustments, maybe go to levels, maybe go to vibrance. And then you just sort of make it a little bit more because it dulls it, I think, a bit. So I think a real nice, bright, colorful thing like that. And you can apply vibrance a couple of times as well. So you've got these lovely streaks of colour. And you can do this for any image. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.